Hello. We are heading in here. In the St. Peter and Paul Cathedral. In Ostend. This is in the uh, northern part of uh, Belgium. Oh, I didn't even know there was a road there. Huh. Welcome, guys. Welcome, welcome. We're heading in now. Check out the detail on this. It's pretty gothic looking. I'm going to see if we can uh, get a close up on some of these carvings. I like these doors a lot. It's very medieval looking. Big fan. Oh, that's really cool. And like stone relief work. Okay, so I'm gonna have to be a little bit quiet because we are going into a church after all. This is inspired by the largest labyrinth in France. It's one of the few remaining original labyrinths that date from around 1200. Wow. Total length of 261.55 meters. That's impressive. This is just a recreation of what an actual labyrinth looked like, I think. We're going to go down one of the sides. I really like this stained glass here. It's kind of minimalist. It's almost like Picasso X. During his cubist, I think that's what you call it, his cubist stage. Hey, the dude, how you doing? Oh, this is very cool stonework. I gotta tell you, I love these. I think these are really, really cool. Looks like we got an organ here. Love these chandeliers. They're very cool looking. In case you're just joining, I'm. I'm Staying relatively quiet because you don't want to be respectful. This is a, a pretty quiet church right now, so I don't want to, you know, step on anybody's toes or anything. I love the stained glass. So cool. Hey, thanks for the share. I appreciate it. Let me come down the center, because this stained glass in the center is so cool. I just want you guys to get a good look at it. Hang on just a second. First off, that's really gorgeous if you didn't see that before. There's a rose window. And on each side, there's this stained glass all the way up there. You can see it on both sides. Of course, no Gothic cathedral would be complete without some beautiful carvings. 
and some awesome columns. This is usually my favorite part of every cathedral I'm in. Is, uh, I'm not sure what you call it, but I think it's just a really, it's always a really pretty piece. Absolutely, I'm glad I could share it with you guys. I'm all over uh, Belgium, so make sure you follow me so that you can uh, catch some of my other stuff. I'm going to be going to the Kuckelberg in uh, Brussels before too much longer again. Hopefully this time I'll have a signal. There you go, guys. That is the St. Peter and Paul Cathedral in, in uh, Ostend. Thanks for watching. Uh, let me give you one more shot of the outside, actually. Hang on a second. So I can go out this way. One more shot of the outside now that y'all can hear me again. That's the train station out there. <laughs> I gotta head back there in just a second. But I should be able to get a feel. Oof! That was rocketing down. Kind of, besides this road right in front of me, this is just a big old courtyard where you can uh, walk up to the cathedral. It's just really nice. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Talk to you soon. Don't forget to follow me. Thanks. Bye.